Hello, this is a picture of a star. It's got a piece of bright yellow paper because then you've done half the work already. It's going to be a mamba to sort of draw it out simply and then start colouring it in as I go along really. Mamba's a funky ship. It's, it looks amazing. Uh, there's, a, there's an advert, uh, the Zorgon Peterson advert. Zorgon Peterson makes the mamba in game. The advert goes, if it's speed and firepower you want, the mamba is for you. Based on a racing prototype, it's the fastest commercially available starship, and it sports enough hard points for a range of devastating weaponry. Whether you're leaving competitors in the dust or running rings around those pesky Thargoids, think Mamba. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> it's okay, it's funny. I mean, it is based on uh, a racing ship. A vintage Mamba, if you will. The original game from 1984. There was Mambas in that. They looked a bit like a Dorito. They looked like a nacho. Little crispy thing. They were. They didn't look like the Mambas do now. They were pointy, triangular things. Anyway, they were pirates normally. Because they were fast and nippy. And uh, they, they, they could manoeuvre. And they were faster than the Cobra that you got in Lee as well, actually. They were faster than you, basically. They were designed in the Riort shipyard, which is one of the old worlds. And of course, Riort's still in game. It's actually in the game news at the moment because uh, the Sirius Corporation just fought a little war with one of the Riort factions there. Just last week, commanders did a bit of shooting of spaceships there. Yeah, that in the story, that's where the Mamba was first designed. And of, it's as I say, it's made by Zorgon Peterson now, so you can get it anywhere really. The old game, you could carry 10 tons of cargo uh, and it had an ergon laser but it didn't have any hyperspace capability which is kind of kind of funny you couldn't get into which space anyway so it's not much cop the modern modern member it's not much cop for trading it's it, you can carry over 60 tons but you wouldn't because it's got no jump range it's got like the worst jump range it's one of the worst jump ranges of all the ships basically you can't mine in it really because again for the same reason you don't want to be going somewhere and then taking it a few systems away to sell because that's going to take you forever in a mamba yeah people use it for zeno because it's so fast and, and it can maneuver around the swarm and it's got five hard points which is actually really not bad uh, it's quite a good ranged hard points and they're all on the top it's a little bit like an fdl but less good really <laughs> you can do multi-crew in it I would say that the best thing about the Mamba is probably the speed and that, that huge hard point, that one huge hard point it's got, which does make it quite punchy. In the beta, apparently, it was an awful lot faster and people got a little bit sorry for themselves. They balanced it back down to a slightly less speedy thing. You know, that was its standout feature and it's not fulfilling that, that heritage now, but uh, it still looks amazing and you can still go very fast in it. Anyway, so that's it. Boosting away from the star. All done, really, I guess. Thank you for listening. I appreciate it.